Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Will, and we are back with some more Batman Arkham Knight. Oh my god. <laughs> so my insomnia is back, so that's not great. Um, so a bit of a warning, today's stream is going to be low energy, and I'm not really sure how long the stream's going to go. So basically was not able to get any sleep last night, and I had the choice of either trying to do my stream now, or trying to sleep and maybe I would, maybe I wouldn't, and then stream in like five or six more hours. So I just decided to bite the bullet and stream now instead of possibly not getting any sleep and then streaming in six hours and being even more out of it than I already am. So here we are. <laughs> I'm going to try to do at least an hour, probably an hour and a half, but I don't know if we'll do a full two. We'll see. But yeah, we are trying to get all three... Robin's heading your way. Let him in when he gets there. Of course. I take it this means you stop one of those monsters. Yes, but I'm not done yet. All right, we're going to take out all... We're trying to retrieve uh, three of the jokers that escaped. On that last one, Bats. <laughs> Remember Jason Todd? Oh, what a whiner. Always complaining. We're both better off without that loser. They drop a lot of hints towards who Red Hood is in this game. There you are. So what do we have here? Poor oh. All alone. You want to hear this? You come see me. Ignore this freak. Just you and Whoa. me, baby. Uh, Weird. It's not like up in the vents. Like he's interested in a fight. Don't you know this guy? He craves something more. Something oh. else. Something creative, something fun. I'll show him fun. Two fists of fun. And then I'm coming to see you, Charisma. I'm gonna smack you so hard, you're gonna be singing like the back of your head. Yeah, tough guy. Well, first, you'll have to find me. And second, well, let's... I have not played in two weeks, so I'm going to need to, you know, get the rest off. You're talking to, boy. You better watch your mouth. Whatever. I should wait until he's in position back. before I detonate the explosive. My money's on me. It's weird that it doesn't go down. We keep hitting the wrong button. All right, it wants me over here, but there's no way to get through. No, I'm not. Oh, okay, so it does have both of them. Oh, it just feeds back into this room. Oh, okay. I thought we were going somewhere else, and I was just like, what? I don't remember this path. I know you're there. Okay, I don't know how to get him to move other than see if we could bait him like that. I'm gonna blow your stinking head off. If I draw him close to the wall, he can be immobilized with an explosive charge. Using the voice synthesizer. I was just gonna say that probably that we have to use this to trump close. Before activating an order, I need to pick a target. Like, I'm gonna blow your I can't give an order without choosing a target first. There's nothing around though. Batman. 
How do we get past here now? Oh, duh. Jesus, Scott. How about the giant red button, Batman? World's greatest detective! Is someone there? Jason, I, I thought you were dead. Batman? Is that you? Batman's not coming to save you, Jason. Go, go. It's been six months now, Jason. I think it's time to face that. Screw you. That's the spirit. You're a real chip off the old bat block. Not that it'll do you any good. Why won't you just kill me? What? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not going to kill you. Not yet, anyway. You're my sidekick now. Imagine it. You and me, out on the streets, starting fights, picking on the weak. A regular dynamic duo. Just like Bats and that new kid of his. No, oh, he wouldn't. You think? So, this isn't Batman, then? Oh, weird. The pointy ears are usually a dead giveaway. No. I didn't want to show you that photo. Really, I didn't. But, well, it was the only way for you to get closure. Now, I know it hurts, but sometimes... You gotta be cruel to be kind. This just makes Batman look like a shitty fucking detective. Like, to such an absurd degree. I mean, the whole reason why he knew that Jason was dead is because he literally had his body in his hands. Let's get the next in point. the comics. So for him to just, like... I don't know, not be able to find him it just like makes it seem like, oh, Joker's so fucking smart in this. It's like, uh, I don't know. It just makes it seem like he's smarter than Batman, which is fucking frustrating, especially since in the first game and then in the second game, Joker kind of fucking sucked. Like in the first game, it was the whole he turned into a monster, which I don't think he's ever done anything like that in the comics before and is kind of lame. And in the second game, he was basically dying. <laughs> Sorry, Bats, but I was planning a duet for us. Can Bird Boy wait out there and listen to us make sweet music together? That's, uh... It's big no-go, bud. Um, hacking. I can't even hack a fucking. Oh my god. This lock is mechanical with no digital components. I won't be able to use the remote hacking device. Henry, I need your help. Of course. Anything. I need you to send me the CCTV footage from the camera in stage C. You can use the computer in that room to do it. Okay, I'll try. Computers really aren't my speciality. You can isolate the data using the panel on the right. Slide your finger along the dial and... Like this? Oh, this technology is very interesting. Okay, I can see the camera. Now highlight the track for the last ten minutes. And Done. So I see. Thanks, Henry. Oh, I know. I was already going in the right direction. Okay, so he hits the bottom button.
at video analysis. Charisma's wearing a bomb vest. There are five other bombs around the room. Got it. Don't be shy. There's room up here on stage for two. <laughs> no, really, I insist. As you can see, the crowd is so excited, it may just explode! Nobody serenades you but me, Bat. Take it away, boys. Take me on home. To the asylum. Never alone. In the asylum. <laughs> Anarchy rule. It was wild. But through it all, you never smiled. Joke's on you. I'm in your head, so look who's laughing now. Remember in Arkham City. I killed your girl. So pretty. That was the night you let me die. But when I looked you in the eye, that's when I knew. We'd be together. Look who's laughing now! I'm stuck in your head and I'm laughing. Ah, I feel you with dread. And A I'm lot of this is just waiting for him to. And I can't stop laughing. What else can I do? Now I'm part of you. I am the cloud, Prince of Crime. And we've had a hell of a time. You're part of me, I'm part of you. And now there's nothing left to do. I just can't wait till I'm in control. Who'll be laughing then? I drove you round the bend and I'm laughing. I'm with you till the end and I can't stop laughing. I killed all your friends and I can't stop laughing. Yeah! <laughs> Ooh, yeah. I think I can taste your... Yeah. Now that my time is near, I'm in your blood, I'm so alive, I only wish you'd let me drive. It won't be long till I make you kill. Who'll be laughing then? Barbara's dead. And That's all the bombs disarmed. Time to take down Charisma. Stop laughing. I'm even dead and I can't. No! Are you fucking kidding me? I did all the bombs and then the fucking takedown didn't work. I was slamming that. God damn. Okay, I think this kind of concept could be somewhat interesting. Although I think they kind of explored this in the Three Jokers uh, storyline that happened not too long ago. Somewhat. Except in that uh, it was a comic story arc, comic book story arc, where... Uh, there's canonically multiple jokers. But I never actually read that story. And it was a much more of a they were all trying to be the joker kind of thing. Where in here it's very clearly it's other people kind of being their version of the joker. Which I think is actually a bit more interesting. Than just a revisiting of previous Jokers. So like there was a Silver Age Joker, the 80s Joker, 90s Joker, and all that kind of stuff. In the uh, three Jokers. But in here it's very clearly like, oh these are just different people just kind of going insane. What else can I do? Now I'm part of you. I am the cloud. Prince of Dry. We've had a hell of a time. You're part of me, I'm part of you. I'm That's all the bombs disarmed. Time to take down Charisma. Wait till I'm in control. Although I do think it is interesting. I drove you round the bend and I'm laughing. I'm with you till the end and I can't stop. Shoulder check. And he's a professional singer? 
Even Alfred seems better than this guy. Good work, Robin. No problem. Call it my contribution to music. Let's get golden tonsils here back to the cells. That, this, hmm. That's weird. Okay, so there's like a green thing that runs back, but it's like... Usually it shows like, oh, it follow it over here. And that's where you have to unlock it at or whatever. But here it just kind of doesn't tell you where to go to unlock. That, hmm. Well, I guess we're not coming back for it. Nothing. Yeah, like the wire doesn't even light up, even though it's supposed to be like green. And I guess we could try to trace it back. Oh, there it is. This. All right. Hmm. That needs to come down. Whatever, we'll come back for it later. But yeah, the thing is, what I was going to say is that, um, obviously I haven't read every Batman story, but I'm not quite sure when Joker's obsession with Batman started. Because, like, there was a period where, like, the Joker was, like, a bad guy and Batman would fight him, but Joker wasn't, like, obsessed with batman i think that's more of a i think maybe that started in the maybe 80s i'm not sure i don't think maybe around the time where uh, jason todd died i think after that is when it started i'll take charisma back to his cell and honestly i think people lean way too far into the whole joker's obsessed with batman Alfred, we're almost done here and we need to make up for lost time prepare another upgrade for the car absolutely sir would you please make your choice? EMP or uh, weapon? Uh, let's go EMP. This localized electro. This localized electromagnetic pulse will instantly scramble drone targeting systems and marvelous. I'll be in touch as soon as it's ready. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, because I feel like. When Joker's, like, hyper-focused on Batman, it's just, like, when it's boring. Like, I'd rather him be focused on just some crazy scheme or whatever. You don't have an ice grenade yet. There we go. Alright, so yeah, I still need to find the ice grenade of some sort. I don't trust those fake jokers. I take orders from Harley and nobody else. Batman's out there and I ain't opening this gate unless Harley says so. You think Batman's gonna come this way? Oh, duh, that's how we do it. He'll be trying to find all those people she let free. Well, he can try, but he's not getting past this gate. You are going to get past this gate by Tango City is to open the gate. Well, he said lock it, and until I hear different, it stays locked. Did you see that guy? Uh, it, oh. Open the gate! I don't get it. What's there to get? Just get the gate open. Okay, but uh, this don't seem right. And the reason why I say that with uh, Joker being obsessed with Batman is because 
Joker killed like okay. I, I don't know the like all the details of the story of when Joker killed Jason originally. Like I know I know a lot of it, but I don't know like the super fine details of it. And from what I know about it, he was running like a scheme in the Middle East, and I don't know if he purposely chose Jason Todd's mom or if that was just a coincidence. But yeah, he ended up killing Jason Todd. And then like went on to do like some crazy shit with the UN and stuff. Which is still fucking insane to this day. That was a storyline that they did. But uh, yeah, in this game series, it really leans into Joker being obsessed with Batman. Hence the whole him torturing Jason for six months. It's like... First of all, Batman, you look shitty as a detective for not being able to find him. When it's the fucking Joker, he's never subtle. And yeah, in the and why it's important is because in the original comics, he just beat the shit out of him and then blew him up. He didn't like keep him sadistically strapped to a chair and slowly tortured him for six months. It's like, yeah, we get it. Joker's a fucking psycho. But before he was doing like more anarchy shit where it's like, I don't care. Fucking explode the building and kill him. Moving on. Where in here, it's like he's more just obsessively doing shit just to fuck with Batman. Where it's like, that's when it just becomes boring because it's just a freaking circle jerk of Joker trying to fuck with Batman rather than Joker trying to actually do just random crazy shit. What do we have here then? <laughs> wakey wakey what's wrong yeah you think I'm going to hurt this is like the number one part that I fucking hate the most about this it's like the whole part of Joker is like he doesn't care about all this other shit at least with the Joker that's obsessed with Batman is solely obsessed with Batman. Everyone else doesn't matter. Oh, please, 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 please. I'll take real good care of him. Anything to make you happy, princess. Just make sure people know he's yours. We don't want him to end up back here, do we? No, we don't, Daddy. I want to keep him forever. No, no, please, please, no, no. Ah! <laughs> yeah, it makes Batman look incompetent, and Jason look like just a shit. Everything okay? You look spooked. I'm fine, Jason. Tim. You haven't done that for a while. There's one left. Come on. Yeah, if your hands are tied... You should still be able to fucking beat the shit out of the Joker. He was never, like, master martial artist. So, like, plus, uh, Tim was the one with violent anger and would beat the shit out of people. So the fact that, like, oh, yeah, the dude let him down and, oh, what's this? It's Robin with his hands tied versus the Joker. He should literally be able to do that. Like, that should not have been, like, a, oh, no... I'm so helpless in this situation. It's like, no, dude, you, you should be able to have that with Batman's training. This is it! The fight of the century! You ready to get schooled, Bats? What do you want to start? How about getting your asses kicked? 101. Nothing to say? Strong sign type, huh? Well, let's see if I can change that. I'm gonna make you come. <laughs> Hang in there, Batman. Give me your bed. Fuck. Ah. Uh. God damn it. Can't take us both as one. Are you ready to be? You think you can stop the Goliath on your own? Okay, I'm not sure what the fuck we're supposed to do with this guy. He's just impenetrable, motherfucker. One bad guy coming up. 
Oh my god, it's just... Nothing works on this guy. It's just doing transfers that's doing damage. Like, none of our fucking tools and whatnot are working. God, how the fuck are these guys not going down? Yeah, I don't know if I'm doing this fight just completely wrong or what. Oh, there we go. Hold on. That was a change up from usual. What do you mean, freak? Are you aware of what's in the DC universe? We are fucking normal ass motherfuckers. <laughs> There we go. Okay, wait, why wasn't I getting that response before? Okay, so I think I wasn't just doing this part when I was transferring before. Jesus fuck! Jesus God. Honestly, this guy is probably the most forgettable out of the three Jokers. Or out of the four jokers in this game. Oh, nice work. You really held your own just now. I'm impressed. You can carry him. <laughs> you do the manual labor. I pretend to be a detective while using a computer. What did this guy eat? A car? Yeah, this guy doesn't seem like... Like, the other two seem Joker-esque. This guy just Batman, felt like a henchman. You have to help me. That Quinn woman and her goons are trying to break in here. There's no telling what she'll do to me. Stay calm, Henry. I'm on my way. All right. Robin, wait here with the infected. I'll go ahead and deal with Harley's men. Okay. So, like, here's the thing. With... Batman and Joker, there's always the moral high ground of Batman not killing the Joker, which always annoyed me, but it's like, fine. At least build, like, a super prison that he literally can't get out of, which Batman actually did do that one time. And, uh... Yeah, one of the, one of the big annoying parts is, like, oh, yeah, when he killed Jason, what did he do? Well, actually, he chased down the Joker and... They got into a life or death situation and he chose not to save them. You know, that whole classic shtick of, I'm not going to kill you. I'm not going to save you either. That Like that bullshit. He ends up doing that with them. And then he's actually gone for a while in the comics. And it's like, okay, fine. You assume he's dead. But then when Joker comes back after that, I think that's when they really start home nailing the whole like, Joker's just straight up obsessed with Batman. And that's at the point where I think, like, no, you should build, like, if you're not going to kill him, you just, just straight up build a fucking prison in the back cave and just literally have to 24-7 manually keep an eye on him. Open. Which, again, he does do at one point, but it's brief.
It, is it the balloons were supposed to pop? I don't know, I thought maybe Riddler related shenanigans. And that leads electricity. So we need something that does electricity and we also need something that's like a uh, breeze grenade. So I think those are the final two items that we need. I wonder if at any point they had like a space prison in the DC universe in terms of like for Justice League villains. Because they have like a lot of weird shit with like Justice League, Justice Society and all this stuff of having like uh, multiple secret bases over the years. I wonder if they ever had like if any of them tried to do like a uh, not a secret prison, just like a super secure space prison. Alright. You think she's okay? Who? It's Batman. Hey, Batman! Where's your little bird friend? You two have a fight? Oh, he didn't fly away all upset now, did he? Oh, what? You wanna come in? Nah, nah. That ain't happening, buddy. I'm sure you two can work it out, huh? The clown princess. Oh, he's right. It's too dead he should. All right, we're going to have to do this again and have them open up the gate. Yes. Let's just hope we don't get orders to open it anytime soon. Oh, wait. Open the gate now. No problem. First she said shut the gate. Now she wants it open. I think she's gone crazy. What, dumbass? I could handle you by myself. He doesn't take you very seriously. Neither do I. Ooh! He's asking for it. Oh, think you're funny, huh? Open the gate! For real this time! If you think you're taking him back to the cell, think again! He's got the Joker in him. They all have. That means they're mine! I'm taking them! Now that would be highly irresponsible of me to allow that to happen. Batman took Mr. J away from me once already. He ain't gonna do it again! You hear that, Batman? I know you're out there! Yeah! Where are you, Bat Freak? What, afraid to face us? How about that? You're a trigger pull away from... Choke slam. Okay, why are they the, her henchmen? Like, before it's like, maybe Joker was doing schemes to bring in money, but Harley just seems obsessively trying to take down Batman or like... Oh my god, what the f I, <laughs> I landed on top of someone else. <sighs> when you see my pudding, tell him Holly sent ya. And she says hi. Yeah, I don't get why they be her henchmen. They are not getting paid for this situation. <laughs> Look hi, how would you like to fight a masked psychopath that will beat your ass? You're taking him back to the cell. Think again! He's got the Joker in him. They all have. That means they're mine. I'm taking them. 
Now that would be highly irresponsible of me to allow that to happen. Batman took Mr. J away from me once already. He ain't gonna do it again! You hear that, Batman? Right, I need to take down guy with knives attached to his arms, number one. Back freak. What, afraid to face us? How about that? You're a trigger... No one puts their hands on the boss, lady. Guess... We're just doing our job. Damn it! Oh my god, so many of these. Oh, thank God I was able to put him out. Oh my God, so many of these dudes. Don't let him beat you. You won't be walking out. Oh my God. Every time I go in, some other assholes like coming in to uh, bogart me. We're getting There we go. Wow. That dude could really take a pounding once he got to the ground. Holy shit. All right, sweet. I'm impressed. What can I say? I'm irresistible. We need to get back to the cells. You take Albert. I've got Quinn. Harley, I'm giving you exactly what you wanted. You just wanted to spend more time with them. You have all the time you want. Put me down, bad freak. Robin, prep the cell. No, no, no! Don't move, Robin. You killed them, didn't you, Henry? <laughs> oh, bad! You're so easy, desperate to see the good in people. Especially when they're bad. Huh? Honey! I'm home! Activating jailbreak protocol. It's also a super hacker. I guess we now know who reprogrammed your security. <laughs> now, if you would be so kind... Go join your friend over there. Go to hell. <laughs> now. Nice move, Henry. Your turn, Baths. Evolution's a funny thing. <laughs> No matter how many obstacles get in its way, the strongest always survives. Still, you know what they say about evolution? Even amoebas can do it. What are you doing? Purifying the gene pool. Even I don't know which side to root for now. Goodbye. It's been... Educational. I changed my mind. Kill, kill, kill him! Now that's... unexpected. 
They're gonna be spectacular. the last Joker. That other cell's for you. I need to stop Scarecrow. When I'm done, I'm locking myself away. What if you fail? You'll be too dangerous. I won't be able to stop you. No, 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 no. You are not going to do this. I love how you just end that conversation and walk away <laughs> instead of trying to resolve this extremely dangerous situation. You need to get in the cell. It's the only choice we have left. That's a defeatist argument, Bats, and you know it! I'm sorry, Bruce, but it's the only way. I know, Tim. I'll stop, Scarecrow. Master Bruce, I'm reading multiple militia forces converging at your location. It's the Arkham Knight. He's found you. I'll take care of it, Alfred. Are you sure? There are rather a lot of them. I said I'll handle it. You'll be fine. Of course I will. You train me. Also, a good note for like Harley. Security lockdown initiated. That uh, this version of Harley came out in like Arkham Asylum, and they kind of made her evolve throughout these games. But this was, but this version of Harley showed up and was like kind of getting story development before the current version of Harley that we know about, where she like breaks away from the Joker and kind of becomes like an anti-hero on the Suicide Squad and whatnot. Like that's the most, like that's how most people think of her after the Joker, where this is actually a pretty unique take of where she just has a full mental breakdown after the Joker and she never like actually moves on after it. So... It's a nice little, like, Elseworlds-esque picture of seeing Harley after the Joker. Opposed to, uh, you know, what's in the mainline comics of just... Trying to, uh, turn her into an anti-hero because people like her character design, so they try to turn her into a good guy. Okay, what, what are we doing here? Don't worry about Robin Batsy. I'm sure he won't die. Well, fairly certain anyway. Hey, I never finished my story about Jason Todd, did I? Have you got something to tell the nice man, Jason? My name is Jason Todd. Who do you hate? Batman. Excellent. Of course you do. Did you get that, Bats? Kid's not yours anymore. He's mine. Mine, mine, mine. To do with as I wish. Hey, I never asked. What's the big secret? Who is the big bad bat? His name? Tell me. Of course, sir. It's... Never could stand a tattletale. That's why I like to work alone. 
No one to spoil the punchline. You should try it sometime. After all, you've seen what happens when you drag your friends into this crazy little game of ours. Yeah, like you need to get in the cell. It's the only choice we have left. Like there is no time. Shit. I realized it the moment too late. Now what? Look, Bats, I didn't tell you that story for the fun of it. Well, okay, I did. <laughs> but there's a moral to the fable of the robin and the clown. Okay, let's try this again. Are they gonna do it again? I messed up. Oh, okay. You need to get in the cell. It's the only choice we have left. No! There we go, there we go. The right no, you're not, Trump. you dickhead. Listen to me! We can help you! You don't need to do this! Alfred! Alfred! You son of a bitch! You cut my communications! Yeah, that's another thing. Like, there's subtle differences. Sir, are you okay? I've lost communication with Robin. Is he all right? He's fine. Faulty comms unit. I'm looking at him now. Thank God. With all that's happening, I feared the worst. Speaking of which, the Arkham Knight has ordered a squadron of tanks into the city to lock it down and reassert control. Thankfully, the EMP weapon you requested is ready for collection. Thanks, Alfred. Yeah, the, the version Arkham Knight version of Red Hood and the comics Red Hood, I'd say is very significantly different, and I'd say... A big part of that is how Joker killed Jason. Hang on, I've got... A minute! If Henry wasn't immune to mad clown disease, then that means there is no cure after all! You had Featherhead slaving away when he could have been saving Barbara! <laughs> It was cruel, selfish, and had horrible consequences. Oh, if you only meant it. If only you figured out how the fuck to work as a team. No, 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 don't tell me he's gone. He's still out there. I know he is. Batman doesn't retreat. I'm sending in reinforcements. Find him. No, nope, that was wrong button. That was dumb on my part. That's what happens when you have too much power.
a highly futuristic slash Tony Stark-esque level of intricate robotics need to be placed underneath this seemingly abandoned building. Do not ask questions why. <laughs> Electromagnetic pulse designed to temporarily scramble drone weapon targeting and divert incoming missiles. All right, cool. Honestly, personally, unless we're talking. The cloud burst. Give me an update. The Batwing is still conducting scans of the entire city, but there is no sign of it. Let me know the instant it's detected. Of course. There are two new situations developing that may require your attention. Firstly, I'm detecting unusual seismic activity on Miyagani Island. Also, I thought you should know I've been unable to contact Lucius for some time. Highly unusual behavior for Mr. Fox. A visit to Wayne Tower might be in order just to make sure nothing untoward has happened. I wonder if that was like a kind of thing on purpose. Because there's like a bit that some people have where it's like Lucius Fox gets fucking kidnapped so like... There was a period of time where he was constantly getting kidnapped or like threatened or some shit like that. And I'm wondering if this is a throwback to that. All right. Uh, but personally, I'm not a big fan of like this insane level of high tech Batman. Like there's a certain level of technology where it's like, okay, that's good. But it's like, what, what have we just seen? It's like that. 100% involves like construction workers and fucking like an entire like lab of people making robotics specifically for this task and to install it and set it up and just like there is no fucking way that you would be able to build that on your own and there's no way that you would have like a team that you could truly trust to do that for you woman is eagerly awaiting your return to the orphanage. Will you really be so cruel as to deny her the chance to see you fail? Lost the Rattler! Are those the ones we need to get behind them? Wait, no, those are normal. Okay, wait. I, I was thinking they were like the different class of tanks that you have to specifically get behind. still have the things to like electrify that we still need to get on everything. Alright. That one we can't do. Okay, so that's main story over there. And they also said Lucius was in trouble.
Wow, okay, a crash on this game. That's crazy. Huh. I did not think a PS4 game would crash on a PS5. But there you go. Telemetry needs to get a new logo. <laughs> It looks like someone did like found like a clip art image, like a default clip art image, and then was like, yeah, that's good enough. <laughs> yeah, why don't I at least make it to Wayne Tower and see what's going on there? Are you kidding me? Again? What the hell is going on? Why am I... Wow. I did not have this kind of issue when I played it on the PS4 when this thing came out. Holy shit, what is going on with this thing? Okay, maybe... Okay, okay. Um... Since we're... Since we continue with the main story... They're adding in more like tanks and stuff in areas, so maybe that's got a part in doing it, maybe? This is fucking crazy bad. Alright, I think we're gonna not be in the car. We're gonna take it slow. And by the way, even the load times on a PS5 for this, this still takes like a few seconds to get through. Which is kind of crazy. Especially since the new Spider-Man game that literally came out just the other day has no load times whatsoever. I think it is the car that was giving us the issue. Wow, that that was bad. Two crashes in a row. Hold on, what's going on here? Oh shoot, it's still locked onto that. I wanted it to be over here. I was like, I feel like we're not going to the right location. Have you heard about this crazy preacher guy? Crazy preacher guy. Oh, dude, don't tell me they're talking about Blackfire. Yeah, I believe that was his name. There's a really cool uh, Batman story called Batman Cult. Which involves like a crazy preacher character. 
Super cool story, and I think very underrated. The office is locked down. I'll need to enter via the elevator in the underground parking lot. Wow, even more underground. Holy shit. How much more underground do you need? more underground can you get you know what scarecrow ivy this arkham knight guy and his giant freaking army i'm getting out of town okay the only okay yeah, yeah we have to go to those underground tunnels Bitties. No fucking way, guy. Oh my god, more of these pricks just keep showing up. Jesus fuck. backhand have you ever backhanded someone so hard they literally flew vertically up into the air all right let's hope this glitch doesn't continue or error or whatever the frick it's supposed to be oh, wait no that's his wing tech holy shit <laughs> That's insane. Hello? Oh, that's literally it. I was expecting, I don't know, some sort of tank fight or like something going down here. Huh. Slightly disappointing. All right. Haha. Uh -huh. Really, it kind of seems like it here is a consistent topic in Gotham every single day for the last hundred odd years. <laughs> Mr. Wayne, I thought you managed to get out. 
It sounds terrible out there. What are we gonna do? Don't worry. This will be over soon. I just need to punch every criminal in the face a couple of times. What? <laughs> Oh. Mr. Wayne, I just finished securing the building. Is something wrong? Anything I can help you with, sir? I didn't think you'd be coming back here tonight. Is there something I missed? Oh, shit. Mr. Fox. He's hush. I thought, okay. God damn it. I think they got this, got me this way in the first, first time I played this as well. Or I thought it was because we were uh, infected with the toxin. It changed us. But it was actually a hush. What's his face? Elliot. Alfred, I'm at Wayne Tower. We had an intruder earlier tonight. He's taken Lucius. My word. Any idea who it is? The identity thief. Thomas Elliot. The surgeon? Good Lord, I remember when the two of you were inseparable. In a way, we still are. He reconstructed his face using grafts from his victims. He looks identical to Bruce Wayne. Why on earth would he do such a thing? He says it's personal. I'm about to find out why. Don't do anything you might regret, son. Yeah, because he's a fucking psycho. Honestly, the, the reasons behind it are pretty lame. Aren't we, Mr. Fox? I have a job for you, Batman. Bring me Bruce Wayne, or I bring down this tower. Why Wayne? The two of you were friends. That brat's family destroyed me. And now, I will destroy him. The Wayne stood by you. Ah, oh, yes, the great surgeon Thomas Wayne. To think he was once my idol. Until he ruined everything. He did all he could to save your parents after the crash. I'm sorry you lost your father. But he saved your mother's life. He denied me what was rightfully mine. The car crash wasn't an accident. It was you. You wanted to kill them. I only want what I deserve. Bruce Wayne had his riches handed to him on a plate. He never had to fight for anything in his life. Now bring me Wayne, or I'll destroy this tower and everything he stands for. This I hate this part. This was way too much of a gimme. Like, really? That's how easy it was? Take your best shot, Tommy. Bruce? That's impossible. I should have... He's getting edgy. When he turns the gun on me, I'll have a split second to disarm him. Too early and he'll kill Lucius. Too late and he'll get a shot off. Kill him. I'll do it! A split second. That those were multiple seconds. Oh, there you go, buddy. My face. Fucking get wrecked. That was a twenty-five thousand dollar desk. <laughs> you have my apologies. Those trees are extinct. <laughs> I'll be reviewing our security. It's all right, Lucius. Are you hurt? I'll be fine, Mister Wayne. I guess that makes me the lucky one. Oh. Not your fault, Lucius. I can't take him to GCPD. Have him locked in the vault here. Of course, sir. Leave it to me. Alfred, I've detained Elliot at Wayne Tower. I'll have him brought to trial when this is over. Oh, thank God. And what of Mr. Fox? He's fine. Oh, that is good news. 
will ensure Mr. Elliot sees justice for his crimes when this is over. All right. That's taken care of. That looks fun. <laughs> that used all the points. Damn you. Close call. Maybe that suit needs another upgrade. All right. Mission selection. Yeah, then who's the killer here? It's gotta be... It's not Zaz, is it? I don't know. That doesn't really feel like Zaz. And then we got a few different missions here. We got one with Nightwing, and we got another uh, Ezreal. Alright. Well, that is gonna be it for today, guys. Like I said, it was gonna be a short one today. And yeah, unfortunately, we had two crashes, which was super weird. Yeah, I definitely think it has to do with um us progressing the main story, which means like, oh, there's more tanks or like things are slightly shifted around in the world. Um, That maybe makes them a bit more dense than earlier area or earlier parts in the story. And yeah, I think just driving our car around at the at the speeds that it was, it was trying to load in too much stuff or something. It just wasn't able to. Uh, probably not because of the PS5, probably because of, like, the coding for the game. Because, yeah, like I said, I, I seen, I've seen a little bit of uh, Spider-Man 2. Like, z zero load times on that game. And that thing is chocked full of, like, people, like, moving parts and NPCs and shit. So it's like, yeah, I, I don't know what would cause the crash in here. But, uh... Whatever. Uh, tomorrow, hopefully, we'll be uh, fully rested and uh, do the normal length stream. Uh, Monday, we'll get back into Legend of Zelda and we'll be continuing uh, looking on the underground and probably can't even remember where we left off. Um, trying to get the final piece that we've been looking for in the underground, the uh, final part of armor. Because we got the uh, tunic and we got the uh, headpiece. We just need the pants. So we're probably going to try to go after that next time uh, on Monday. And then Tuesday will be a Genshin Impact. But yeah, that is it for today, guys. Thank you for coming out and hanging out on a very chill and somber uh, day 1145 of streaming in a row. And yeah, like I said, tomorrow, some more Batman Arkham Knight. Words. Anyway, see ya.